Wildfire smoke is hanging so heavy on Indianapolis right now. It's even obscuring the downtown skyline from our view here on the canal. Experts say this can even be deadly to those most vulnerable. From the air, the road, or just walking around, you can see the heavy smoke putting a haze over central Indiana. Even people who don't have underlying respiratory issues are likely to have some breathing trouble with it. Dr. Nadia Krupp, the director of Riley Children's Asthma Program, wants everyone to take this wildfire smoke seriously, especially those with underlying conditions. You may end up in the emergency room or the hospital or worse. There's probably going to be fatalities around the state related to this uh, for our most vulnerable. For those who breathe easier, you could still end up with a headache, sore throat, or irritated eyes. For the next few days, the, the main thing you can do is just to stay inside. Dr. Gabriel Filippelli has monitored air quality in Indy for five years. He says the smoke from these Canadian wildfires has caused the worst air he's ever seen in Indy, much worse than what we saw a few weeks ago when the smoke first rolled through. The level of, of air pollution reached up to this level of about 150. This is the air quality index. Right now, outside my own home, it's about 215. Indianapolis has hovered around and above a 200 on the air quality index Wednesday, firmly putting it in the purple or unhealthy for everyone category, like so much of the Midwest. Here's the situation. You can, there's nowhere to go that's safe, basically, other than inside your home. You can't go to Chicago or Pittsburgh or anywhere. Krupp recommends wearing a mask if you go outside, but says you should stay inside as much as possible, especially kids and the elderly. My kids are staying inside all day today and tomorrow. Um, I said, sorry, kiddos, your, all of your outdoor activities are canceled. Even as the wildfire smoke clears, folks most impacted could deal with the impacts longer. People could have a lingering cough for several weeks. Even when this round of wildfire smoke moves on, it probably won't be our last. A majority of Canada's hundreds of wildfires are burning out of control right now, and the country isn't even halfway through its typical wildfire season. Reporting downtown, Eric Graves, CBS4 News. Help